welcome back to our monthly podcast. My name's Julie from So Unique and this is my daughter Adele. Hello. Um, I will pop all the links down below uh, where you can find us both on social media. Because uh, we've both got Etsy shops. Etsy yeah. shops. And you've got your and website. And I've got a website as well. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, this is September's podcast. Mm. We're back again. <laughs> um, Right, should we start off? Should we do? Should we cover the theme first? Or I don't know, give away, give away first. Yes. Right, yes. So we're running a bit away. late. Yeah, we yeah, are. We're... We are running a bit late, aren't a we? Bit. What day is it? Six days late. Oh, um. Well, if you watched the vlog, you'll know I had a week where I wasn't <laughs> so in that lot of motivation really. But of course, then I've been trying to catch up, sewing and everything. Um, and we are weather dependent because if it's raining, we're in the conservatory. We've mm. got a, an acrylic roof, haven't we? So <laughs> you wouldn't hear us. No, I <laughs> And I don't know, I, I like to film on a Sunday. If it's quieter normally. But I think there's somebody streaming or something. Yeah, there's somebody if you can hear a noise, yeah. something's happening because usually at this time of the afternoon it is quiet. Yeah. Uh, and then. Do you want to show me back? Adele, you had got a second job. So oh, for yeah. hours, sort of were in the middle of the day, mm. or in the afternoon, when we so we couldn't podcast her because she wasn't here. Yeah. So then comes Friday, it was a day off, you know. And obviously I, I needed to get in the shop and sort that out. So yeah, that was that. And then we've had Kevin clutching the conservatory up with his junk. Because mm. the conservatory, we use it, don't we, for all sorts. Yeah. We all use it for filming, for taking photographs, for uh, Instagram, Etsy, mm. eBay, whatever. The trouble is Kevin doesn't like to tidy up. No, he does not. So we've banned him. He's gone. He's, he's, he's not even in the house. <laughs> we kicked him out. We kicked him um. out. He's gone over to my other sons because Kevin uses the garage for mending his bikes and that. So he's been banished to there and mm. for tomorrow. <laughs> So it's all quiet. Even the cats are quiet. For now. For now. Yeah. They've, been, they've been fed, so they're all quiet. Anyhow, right, we'll start off with the giveaway. Mm -hmm. So this is the giveaway for July. And it said September then. <laughs> and that's the in August. 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 Oh, God. <laughs> I need a gin. <laughs> So, it's our box of that. And these are all Instagram and YouTube. Yes, mainly YouTube this time. So, if you want to dig in down and pick somebody out. What have we got? Wendy Carew Ke off YouTube. Wendy. So, I don't know. So congratulations Wendy, so if you want to get in touch with me, um, if you're on Instagram you can send me a private message on there um, or on YouTube I'll pop my email down below. It should be there. So then you just give me a quick email and I will get that out and post to you. Mm -hmm. So congratulations. <laughs> Thank you for everybody who took part. Mm -hmm. We do them every month. We do, so do them every back. month. Yes. All right, so now we can get into the theme. I need a sip of tea. Well, if you well, look at my mug, yeah. See if anyone can guess. If you can see what it, I don't know if you can see what it is, mm. but it's strawberry thief. Yes, which is a William Morris print. Um, who you know more about William Morris than I do. Yeah. Well, <laughs> go, go on, announce your theme. Yes, it's the, it's the month of September, Liberty Month. As in so Liberty, Liberty Fabric, yeah, not Liberty of else. London. Liberty of London, that's mm -hmm. it. Yeah. So, <laughs> not the Statue of Liberty. <laughs> <laughs> no, so I've made some project bags, mm. two different styles, and we've got a bit of fabric in. Yes. Now, I have Look. <laughs> I have taken photographs of all this, so I will put them in at, in at the end. Yes. But we are going to be stocking Liberty Fabric by the bulk. Eventually, eventually. Or I've got some coming in, but I'm only sort of dipping my toe in the water, mm -hmm. really, because 
you know it's expensive for me to purchase yes. um if it doesn't sell i don't want to be i've got stuck with it do i no <laughs> really oh they're strawberries so we have got some strawberries these haven't we is that the same as my mug yeah it's <gasps> the same pattern it's got i think it's a, is it a thrush it could be i, I don't think know it is. Really. so yeah it's a william morris print he was very big in the arts and crafts movement uh which is the style that liberty is actually built in it's not a mm. tudor building it's a mock tudor building mm. so it, it's just done that style but it's very pretty inside it's a lot of wood carving and it's got it's like well, a figure eight it looks tudor doesn't it yeah it does look tudor. All, the, all the beams and yes. that but it's got these two <sighs> massive atriums going through yeah. the building at christmas it's very it's, nice oh, i love liberty yeah, yeah. And, uh, i like to go and wander around even though i don't have that much mind you what what we've bought is like mainly fabrics, isn't it? Yes, because it's a department um, store. Bits and bobs. Yeah, so it's got all sorts in. I've got a sewing box and all a needle case and stuff. Things you so, bought me for my birthday, didn't you? Yes. Two years ago. Yeah, we went down a few years ago as a combination birthday and Mother's Day present mm. for you. Yeah. yeah that's so yes, one floor is mostly fabric and wool and things like that. Do I have one? Oh. That was in the other part. <clears throat> well, they are sort of world famous for their florals, so that's what we've got. We've got all florals, haven't we? Yeah. yeah. Apart from the strawberry thief, which is it is still counts as a floral. Got florals in, yeah. but yeah. But like the nice thing with this sort of little collection that we've got here, um, it all goes together. Yes. So it's perfect for the English paper piece then. Now I have been asked when I do sell it if I will sell small pieces for the English paper piecing like mm. I'm going to show them while you're talking 16th which yeah that's fine with me I don't mind if that's what people want um so I'm hoping I can sort of snaffle a little bit for myself so I can do a bit of paper pieces <laughs> but we'll have to see about that mm -hmm. that's but, very uh, nice yeah that reminds me of like an English meadow, that one. That one looks like that jug you've got in the kitchen. Mm, it does a bit. Yeah. Like that one as well. If you, if you try to pick oh, things that go yeah. together. Oh, and that's your plain one. Yeah. That's like, what is it? I see that, that one. one. Yeah. But you chose so it to go with. It does actually blues. go with everything that's here. Yes. So I might get some more plain then. Have to get some. You've got, have you got photos of all these? Yes. <clears throat> Yes. Very subtle. So you're going to be chopping these up to sell. Yes. Is that what we're saying? Yeah, yeah. And like I said, the rest of it will be in. They did tell me September, but the way things are at the minute, you just don't know. True. Because I'm still waiting on the the bolt of Halloween fabric that I thought had come in the other day, and uh, most of it has. I'm waiting for one bolt of fabric. <laughs> Turn that one's nice. I like that one. That reminds me of a wild meadow as well. It has, has it got strawberries in all? Yeah, it's got tiny strawberries tiny there. Strawberries. Wild strawberries then, yeah? Yeah. I would assume yeah, so. That's nice. Yeah, I like this one. Yeah. Very small. Yeah, I like oh, that. Nice. Yes. Yes. So uh, that's going to be a fun month there, isn't it? Yes, because this is sort of, isn't this the kind of the, the test pile to see how much people like it and then yes. you're going to yes, get Liberty right. Fabric yeah, in yeah. if it all well, goes I have, well. Well, I have got some coming in anyhow, oh, okay. but just a small amount. Yes, yeah. well, it is expensive. It is very expensive. And is, so, is this Tan Alon? This is Tan Alon, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Um, but like I say, it'll be, what I've just showed you now, that'll be going on the website well as soon as possible really yeah um that's what i'll be doing probably tonight <laughs> probably, and probably tomorrow as well because it usually takes me a while to do mm -hmm. uh yeah that'll be going on the website um and then anything else sort of liberty wise will just be coming in over the over the month mm -hmm. but if you've signed up for the newsletter ah yes now I did send it out last month. It was a bit later on, wasn't it? It was middle it of the is. month. So if you have signed up for the newsletter and if you didn't receive receive it, check your spam box just in case it went in there. Yes, because 
We but did a test and it sent to me just fine, but when it sent to yours, it got put in the spam folder. Yeah, so I find yeah. a lot of stuff in my spam folder. Yeah. It's strange because we both use Google. Mm. So it's both know. in Gmail. So it's you think it's something to do with your settings and the computer or how it's been set up? I actually don't know. Mm. I don't know. But yeah, it came, it came through to me, but if, <clears> if you've signed up and you haven't got it, just check your spam folder. Yeah, so there'll be a, another newsletter going out. Soon. Soon. When, whenever you've got this up on the website. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and then you know, we can keep people updated of like when, when things go on the website, yeah? Pretty much. Yeah. We're not planning on sending out a Loads. lot. No. <laughs> no, that's no. annoying when your company sends you multiples. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, let's get well, into the bags. We'll get into the bags now. Now, there's six different Liberty prints here. Now, I have mm. photographed all these, I'll let you show. Mm -hmm. um, now, I, I cannot remember what the collection's called. I'm sure it was Flower Show, if that rings a bell, but this is Liberty Cotton. Now, mm. this is really nice. I've really enjoyed sewing with this. So, that's the first one. If I can find out what the names are, of the fabric I will do mm -hmm. but this is a nice small project bag perfect for like a sock project or anything small it's got a little tab on the side um, the top channel and the side tab are petite fabrics mm -hmm. and the cord is <clears throat> like a satin yes uh, they're all nice and small handbag size they've all got a box bottom and the lining is cream with like a i think it's a white daisy design inside which is quite yeah. pretty so it's all all in keeping oh i like this yeah, one that was nice i like the way with this yeah i think roses is my one of my favorite things at the minute i want to get some roses for the garden we know <laughs> you've mentioned that I know, I've only got one little one there to go in. That's nice as well. I like that one. That's probably the honest, brightest one, that one. I do like the roses one, but I, I really think that one's my favourite. And I think it's because it's the purple. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I think it's maybe that one. But, I mean, but having said that, I do like them all. Mm -hmm. They're all nice. These are going up on the website. They'll be going up on the website. Yeah. So I've photographed everything. So. It shows you with the ball of yarn in, what it all looks like from side to side and everything. Mm -hmm. And these are going in product of the month. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Well, it's, at, it's at the top of the list anyway, yeah. isn't it? It's, the first, it's it. the first thing because obviously it's going to say product of the month. Sept it does say just September at the minute, so I will change that to put Liberty, Liberty in there, mm -hmm. Liberty Fabrics or whatever. Um, so yes. What are these? There's another six. Well, I suppose you call them project bags. They are flat. Now, this is what was left over. I've used all my fabric up this time. I didn't want any waste. Mm -hmm. So I've had to do things a little bit differently. But it's got a sort of front zip and it's the same cream fabric inside. So you can you could have them um, as a matching set. As a matching set, you mm -hmm. know. I mean, if you like to knit socks, then. And I was thinking, actually, for the paper piecing, like if you're out and about or going mm. to work or in the car, you um. could put a few bits of your paper piecing in there to keep them nice and safe. Because I think that's what I'm going to do. I was thinking crochet hooks, but yeah. Well, yeah, well, you could put anything in. You could put your crochet hooks in. You could put um, pens in, anything mm -hmm. really. Um, stickers for your journal in, anything like that. So these are all match the... Yeah. Um, project bags and I can't tell you what size they are at the minute because I haven't measured them but all the details will be on the website so the yeah these are all going on the website mm -hmm. and it's got lace on front and back yes. mm. and this is the last two Mm. Or you can put your cross stitch in as well. A small, Actually, you yeah, if you, a your small, ring would probably go yeah. in. Or if you've got any uh, felt kits, any of our felt kits that you've been making, mm -hmm. you could pop them in and you then you can take it out and about with you. Yeah, I guess it's more like a travel bag. It is. Now that's, like, oh, you could use it as one. That's the only one that's got a coloured zip. <laughs> all 
the what others... do you mean? You know you're supposed to make things All match. the others have got cream in. Zip. I think what happened was I'd run out of cream, cream zips and I just spotted no, that one. Good it goes. Well, yeah, that's the only reason it's in there because it goes. <laughs> um, I am working on another project bag. It's patchwork. Mm. And that's in blue and sort of teal, isn't it? Pale teal. Well, blue. Mm. Talking about teal. Are you talking about that Liberty set? Yeah, yeah. But it is. It's like a, or would you call it aqua? Mm. Aqua. It's closer to an aqua. Close, yeah. Yeah. So that's a patchwork one, which I'm still working. Well, I've done all. I've sewn all the patches together, but it's now finding the fabric to go with it, and I haven't got anything at home. For the channel and for the bottle, so I want to make it a little mm. bit of a bigger bag. Um, yes. Uh, that. <laughs> I don't think it's big enough. No, it's not mm. big enough. We've got a Liberty handkerchief in our kitten pouch. Well, yeah. Well, I remember I used to go to London every year just to mm. just to go, and so sometimes I'd go into Liberty and I'd pick up a handkerchief. It's cheaper than buying fabric. So you I got really that one. Your nails on that no, one. I wouldn't. But I never thought of what so I was going to do nice. with it. So I got that one as well. Uh, so yeah, you. I like I'm letting that. you have them. <laughs> yeah, I like this stuff. So that would make a nice. I don't know what I'm doing. Would I put it well? Because it, it's kind know. of. It's. It um, seems a shame when it's the finished product. I know. But I do like. I think this is. It's this kind is of my, more of a silky. My cut. This is the tamalo on this one. Is it? This is Tamalaw. I think. Yeah. Oh, okay. I would say so. Tamalaw. Does, does it not tell you on the package? It feels, it feels like Tamalaw. It just says small punch hanky. It's punch. <laughs> don't know. But no, I like that. That's a lovely colour. Yeah, that is a nice colour. Would you call it aqua though? Yeah, close. I think you would, wouldn't you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So you've got some hanky cheese that might make it into the mix. You'd have to uh, put a backing on though. Make a nice little cat hat. <laughs> little, little, oh yeah, little cat collar. <laughs> oh yeah, they're too fancy. We're not putting those on our cats. We're ruining them. Oh dear. Um. Yeah. Well, I did have another set of um patchwork squares to do another bag with, but when I started stitching them together, I think I don't know if someone must have been drunk that day, but they were all wonky. <laughs> In a terrible state. As in, they were wonky, or you sewed them together? Wonky. I didn't sew them wonky together, no. They, they weren't cut right, so I don't know, unless I had something new in that day learning, but oh, they were dreadful. Oh, no. It's not as if they can be taken back because um, they've been a few years. Yeah, we, we're talking about the, the, oh, the packs dear. of squares that we bought from Liberty of their fabrics. They yes. do, somebody does them for them, I think. They cut out little squares and they put them in packs and they sell them in store. So you had a couple of those yeah. and I had, some, I had some before didn't I to stitch that a sampler, yeah. that London sampler. Actually I'll have to get a picture yeah, you're of that. Have to put a picture I'm gonna have to get somewhere. a picture of that. I'll put that in um this week's vlog. <clears throat> Good job you fixed the spelling mistake on it. Yeah. What did I spell wrong? You spelt London with an A. I have no idea <laughs> with that. It's no. easily done now. I don't know why. You're spelling but... it with an accent, London. Yeah. <laughs> But yes, I made a, a sampler. Mm. Um, look, sorry, I've got some bit of tea. It looks like a Union Jack. Yeah, because it's got patchwork. pieces yeah. coming out, but it's got the the Liberty patchwork panel in the centre, mm -hmm. and then bits of fabric coming out to sort of look like a Union Jack. And then in these spaces, I embroidered where we'd been, where we'd visited, and everything, yes. and where we stayed. And was that our second trip, or was that our first? <coughs> I think that might have been the first trip. Yeah, because yeah. you had been to London in years, absolutely mm -hmm. years, <laughs> years. Mm -hmm. So yeah, so it's I've made it so it can be a cushion, but I've also put a couple of loops on to hang it up on the wall, and I have it hung up down at the shop because mm -hmm. I like it down there, but. I think where it is now down there, it's sort of hidden, so I think I'm going to take it down and bring it home. Yes. But yes, I will put that in this week, mm -hmm. so you can see it. So, as I was saying, the pieces weren't very good, so I decided not to trim them up. I couldn't be bothered, <laughs> I got that bit fed up with them. So I decided to make some Liberty Marbles for Christmas. Mm -hmm. uh, in the Oops. 
Yeah, this one shows up. Yeah, that one shows up, and I've just decorated it up. I will take some proper photographs and pop them in. And so all the fabrics just pasted on. All the fabrics, yeah, it's a glass bauble underneath. No, don't drop it. <laughs> yeah, but I, I really enjoyed doing that, and I think out of the fabric that I've got, I might be able to get four, maybe five bauble's out. <clears throat> Now this one, it's the same thing again, but I've put glitter on. And it's you put all the glitter on. It's an iridescent glitter. Yeah, but it's it's not a fine one like I'd normally use. I mean, it looks alright on camera actually. I didn't think you would pick it up. Yeah, but, but you can still see got, the pattern. You can still see the pattern, but it's quite it's subtle, isn't it? Yeah. I am gonna. I think I'm gonna get some fine glitter. Yeah, or maybe just add more glue to glitter ratio. Mm. I mean, all I did was first it was glue and then took the glitter off. And <sighs> you know, our Christmas tree is going to tip over one of these days. What stuff we put on it? I know. A Christmas tree is we, full. <laughs> we get more baubles each year. Yeah, we don't get a bigger tree though. No, we don't. So mm. I guess that's what I've been doing the last couple of days. Are you gonna do a tutorial? Yeah, if I've got time. <laughs> Yeah, surely you've got time before Christmas. This uh, time. Oh, I'm, not, I'm not promising anything. <laughs> no, because if I say yes, I will do one, then something will happen and I won't do it. <laughs> but yes, I'm going, I'm going to make some of these up. Mm -hmm. yeah. I, I must admit, I like making baubles. We know. I might put um, some in my Etsy shop this year. Some really? different kind of baubles. Yeah. I'm not saying Liberty ones, but actually, I might do because if I've got scraps of Liberty fabric, I'm going yeah, to save it. Yeah, I've got some bits already, aren't there? So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to find a box and give it the scraps. Mm -hmm. oh. uh, mm. Have you explained about your paper missing plan? Your paper missing plan? No, not yet. Oh, okay. have, uh, you, should, you should tick things off the list of that. Yeah, yeah, we've done the Liberty fabric, we've mm -hmm. done the Liberty bags, we've done the baubles. Oh. <coughs> yeah, you're onto your paper piecing thing, whatever you're doing with that. Okay. Well, I have been asked if I would put together a beginner's set for paper piecing, which mm -hmm. I've, you know, I've said yes I will do. So that is something that's going to come this month, I'm not sure when. I've been mm. waiting for products to come in, which I think everything's in now. Mm. I, th I think. There might be one thing actually that's not in. But as soon as everything comes in I will put something together so there'll be some fabric um uh hexagon shapes oh your actual paper pieces uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah yeah um i'm not going to cut the fabric because i think people need to do that mm. themselves and they learn how to do it yeah uh, and some glue and needles and thread mm -hmm. and things like that so that will be coming this month I'm not, mm. I'm not sure what, I mean, it'll probably be cotton fabric, but um, obviously if the Liberty fabric takes off, then I might do some Liberty boxes as well. Yes, well this is the test of month, isn't yeah, it, for Liberty yeah. fabric, see how it goes, see how interested so, people are yeah, in we'll, it. We'll see, we'll see what happens. Mm -hmm. Right, what uh, else? Uh, ah, what are we doing for Christmas? What are we doing for Christmas? Okay. <laughs> not a lot, I don't think. <laughs> We're going to be too busy, I think, at Christmas. Yeah. Shall we tell them? Yeah, so. Uh, <laughs> we've, we've got a nice, well, we, we've got a nice surprise. It's a nice surprise for us. We're getting. Oh, that surprise. Oh, right. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, we're doing it now. Yeah. Mm, yeah. We're getting two little black kittens mm. in about five weeks' time. They're yeah. only three weeks old at the minute. Yeah. It's from a friend. Um, she sort of collects cats, I think, really. She has more than what we've had. Um, and she, I think she got a couple of strays. Yeah, and it wasn't her fault. <laughs> uh, they were young and... They got loose or something, didn't they? I think they got loose or something. They've mated. Okay, they got frisky. Yeah, <laughs> so... Yeah, the mum... Yeah, she's had kittens. So, yeah. And it's a, the mum's a beautiful cat. She's... She's a bit like Elsa, colouring wise. Yeah, she's white. But she's got a bit of ginger just on her head here yeah. by her ears. And yeah, I've been sent some photographs of mm. her mum feeding the baby. So, mm -hmm. 
So we're going to have fun with two brothers mm -hmm. <laughs> this Christmas. I don't know if the Christmas tree will be going up. Uh, we'll have to do it when um, oh, you put a big cage around the tree so the cats mm -hmm. can't get oh, in. We might have to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we had fun last time we had the kitten. But, uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> One minute they sat there, the next minute they were up. Mm. Now there's going to be two. I oh, know. Yeah, well, we don't know what they're going to be like. They oh, might no. be. You don't know. They might be good little kittens. Don't mess about. I think it's unlikely. I think but... that's <laughs> unlikely. They're going to be too interested in, too mischievous, and who knows? Like. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, well, that, the world won't be getting them to like mid October. No. But when we do get them, we'll then. Um, well, we'll put one in, won't we? Say hello. Mm -hmm. Oh, we will. <laughs> so they'll either be in the, make an appearance in the vlog or on the podcast because mm -hmm. undoubtedly they'll be up on the table wanting to get in on the app, won't they? Maybe, yeah. We know what cats are like until they get a bit older. Yeah, I'm going to say the other two. They, can, they learn not to go places they're not meant to go. Mm, but not when you're looking. <laughs> no, the amount of cat hair I had to get off this <laughs> table before we started. Yeah. The trouble mm. is, you never see. You get on, do you? She's sneaky as Elsa. <coughs> uh, I think it was Charlie, Charlie Fluff. Charlie Fluff. Mm. I don't know. Um, but I was talking about the other thing. Oh, what was that? The thing we're doing. Oh, the Christmas, the Christmas, Christmas box. box. Christmas yeah. box, right? Okay, go on then. We're doing, we're doing a Christmas box, which will go live sometime this month, won't we? Yeah, yeah, we haven't got everything well, done yet. Yeah, we haven't got everything done. We haven't got a date yet. It's not a Christmas Eve box, nor is it a calendar box, because there are a lot of people doing those. Mm, no, they're not. Uh, um, yeah, so we didn't want to want to do something different. So what we're doing, we mentioned it, I think, last podcast. But now we have yeah. a name for it. We're calling it a Festive Feelings box, and it's intended to be opened on December the 1st. And it's going to have things in it that you can do during December, craft wise, like little craft kits, nothing, nothing intense. Nothing too complicated. Yeah, yeah. it's like yeah. Yeah. you want easy, don't you, when it's Christmas? Because oh, yeah. you want something to relax with and something to enjoy. And well, if I you want to remake them for people, yeah, yeah, you need it to be simple, don't you? Yes. Not time consuming. And plus, who doesn't make a million plans for December into the like one? Yeah, oh, that's it. I never get anything done for me in December, really. <laughs> so one of the kits we're doing is this little guy. This is the first pass. Phantom name. What 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 name did we pick for him? Is it Norbert? Norbert. Yeah. Norbert. Yes, this is Norbert the gnome. Oh, is it? Um, yeah. his nose is not going to be that colour. We're waiting for noses coming yeah. in. <laughs> it doesn't look too bad actually, but in real life yeah. it is bright pink. It is very pink. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, the other noses haven't come in yet. These are just little pom-poms. Yeah. So the theme of the box is is Tomties. Little little gnomes. Because we found last year that they were quite popular when I made some charms. So everything in the box is going to be themed around. And it's gnomes. very, very simple to make, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, because yeah, it's just you got your hat, your body. And then, little, his little yeah, beard. Little beard that you put and, gold thread on. And you don't have to put stitch the gold thread on, you can just leave it plain because yeah. you know that's just something I added on to it. So that I'll have to I put like that it. on the pattern now. No, no, thank you. <laughs> Change, changing things after I've printed. And you can put a little pom pom on his hat as well, yeah. which I haven't put on, I forgot. Or you could put a little bell on maybe. Yes. Something yeah, like you that. Can do. You know, you can put, add these little things to make it more your own. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that'll be coming this month. I'm going to be making Tomtis. Yeah. I like stitching Tomtis because you can sit and watch the telly and it's not complicated. Mm -hmm. and anybody can do it. I mean, I've blanket stitched everything apart from obviously the back stitch on the beard. Yeah, but, um, the nose is just glue, isn't it? The nose is just glued on, but yeah. you could stitch it on. Yeah. But you know, a bit of hot glue will be fine. Mm -hmm. So this is the one one of the kits and we're aiming for three. Mm -hmm. You want to do one that's um a little tree, mm -hmm. a little sewn tree. Little tree yeah. So we've that's got, just gonna we've be fabric. Got, we've got to have English paper piecing in there, haven't we? Definitely. As long as it's simple. It will be simple. <laughs> I don't know what the third kit's going to be yet. Uh you were thinking fabric tags. 
Oh, right, yeah, yeah. Present, yeah some present present somebody did actually ask me about Tiger Stripes before, didn't they? Yeah, it's either, it was either yeah. that or coasters, fabric yeah. coasters, so. Yeah, oh, well, we'll, it's we'll, we'll see, we'll see. We'll see what we can do. Yeah, so we're just, we're still in the design phase. <laughs> yeah, I think we're a little bit behind, aren't we? Yeah. Both of us. So these are the designs I've come up with, and they're all going to be based around this. We want to put a mug in as well. So we're going to. A nice sweet drink. Yeah. And some sweet treats. Now they're being busy. Look at these, aren't they gorgeous? So I've been doing some watercolour gnomes. And these... They've taken a while, haven't they, Dad? No, <laughs> it takes several days. <laughs> but they're nice. Mm -hmm. Really nice. So yeah, we want those like lined up around a mug. I think will be nice. They might not all fit on, but... And hopefully like a, like a pencil case or a pouch. Mm. Put them on, put on fabric, and I might do some snowflakes for the background. That'd be nice. I mean, that one you could have poinsettias. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Holly background, anything really. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like that. Mm -hmm. I get them. I know. I've got to. <laughs> I've got still got to scan them in and take off the background and then line them all up and stickers. We could do stickers. We could yeah. do stickers because if anybody journals, mm. I mean, like for me, if, when I make my project bags, the, if I had stickers, that would be lovely. Yeah. Make some tags as well, wouldn't it? Mm, yeah, well, mm. I think you could just cut these out as they are and punch a hole in. That's a tag, isn't it? Well, you could do. Yeah, it's not big do. enough. Well, yeah, you could do, or you could just pop it on the proper tag. Oh. Mm. Yes. So those are going to be available pre-order probably by the end of the month when we've got some pictures of, of things we've actually done with these. Yeah. So yeah, but so there's going to be a felt kit, probably two other kits, some paper piecing, mm. something else with fabric, and then hopefully a mug, maybe a pencil case, and then some sort of stickers. That's going to be busy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad I've uh, tidied the shop off. <laughs> you had help. I had help, yes. Yeah. Yes. And I've even got my chair now to go down. Yeah. I've got this wooden, oh, so it's a captain's chair that I got from the charity shop. I think Kevin found it in the charity shop years ago. Mm. And he come trotting across and said to me that there was this chair on casters in there. Did I want it? So I says, yeah. Mm. You know, I had it down at work and then I brought it home. Mm -hmm. And it's been out in my sewing room, so I've had two big chairs out there plus a stool, so I don't leave a lot of space. <laughs> no. But it's got arms on, and it doesn't. You can't get under your work top with arms on, can you? On a chair. No, I don't like arms so, on my wooden chairs. Yesterday, Kevin took the arms off, and it's still quite stable the chair. So mm -hmm. that's it. I've got my cushions because the seat base is quite big, and if you sit back. My feet don't touch the floor, yeah, <laughs> and I have to have a cushion to sit on because it's wood then, and I need a cushion at my back. Mm. So it's sorted, so I can go down on there, mm -hmm. and I've got all this fabric and thread bits stuck in the caster. That was gross. And we had to, well I did a bit yesterday pulling it out and Kevin did the rest, but they were like just round balls in this little cover, mm -hmm. and every bit of fluff you went over it just kicked it up mm. now my good chair that i've got the casters are completely different mm. and it's not picking any fluff up so which is good so at least this is saved me having to buy another chair for the shop yeah so i've got more space to sew in now mm. <laughs> so i'm happy mm. <laughs> so yes i'll have more time now good you're yeah. gonna need it sewing 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 yes. it's in september yeah mugs yeah, we got to get the uh, the mug printer back out. And... Yeah, well, the machine is here. Okay. I thought I'd sent it over to the shop, but I haven't. So I found it today. So yeah, we just need to get some inks. Yeah, seen the printer. I think I could do a phone case. A sublimation phone case. I could have a gnome for I mean, Christmas. Uh, maybe. I'm not sure. If you can do it, I just don't know how they do it. I've got You're to look into again. it. You're running again. I'm not walked in yet. God. <laughs> I wonder what pie and things are. <laughs> I just mm. get a bit excited because mm. I want to know. <laughs> Tom, say. Being excited. <laughs> yeah. Close your eyes. Oh, gosh. What? Close your eyes, man. Huh? <laughs>
I don't yeah. like it no, when people say you close your eyes close and put your hands eyes. out. No, but well, I don't know how you put your hands out. <laughs> Keep your eyes closed. <laughs> What's the problem? Is it something liberty? Stop kissing! Have a look. Yeah, you can look. Oh, it's liberty. It is actually. Yeah. I'm about to say, when did you go to London? But you went to London. Oh. Yeah, I got to go to London oh, the other week. Oh, wow. It is. It oh, was the crazy. Oh, wow. <laughs> is it a pink cushion? Yeah, it's a pink cushion. Oh. Look at that. Oh, God, you can open it. Oh, <laughs> Do you know, I've seen sort of beehive things on, online and think, oh, that's nice. I'd like one of them. Oh, that's gorgeous, that. Yeah. I hope you're showing it. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, right. So it's, uh, it's made with the Liberty Frag. That, that's the pattern I like. It's called Loden. That's nice, that fabric. It is. I might have to look for that. Yeah. I've got oh, one somewhere. Oh, I've got other. You've left the price tag in as well. <laughs> Yeah, well, <laughs> I'll not look. Yeah. Oh, these. Yes, yeah, so I was trying to pick colours that you didn't have, but I don't know. That's my box, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, I think it is. Oh, so, yeah, anyway, ones. I was going Thank through you. London last week very yeah, quickly. Sure and I had a flyby visit to Liberty. It was the fastest I've ever been through, and I just grabbed you. So, so she's telling me she can't go to Liberty. Well, I didn't think I'd get time, but I was actually quite close. We <laughs> went you, down Oxford Did you go with on your own? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I have to make myself something now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Counts as your Christmas present. Does it? Yeah. Ooh. It's expensive. <laughs> well, I, I know that. Well, yeah, I think it is, though. Blimey. Mm. Thank you. Mm. You should have just given me that. Well, I'm <laughs> Thank you, Dad. That is lovely. Yeah, well, lovely. You, when I before I went, you were unsure whether you were doing Liberty this month, and then when I come back, you're like, I'm doing Liberty. I'm like, oh, good job, I bought it now. <laughs> so you're getting it yeah. early. Oh, it just makes that. more sense. Yeah. Yes. So, you know, I thought when I saw the hexagon. Oh, these are five inch. Ah, right. Yeah, yeah, I got you. So I've got two and a half inch squares mm -hmm. and five inch squares. Mm. And got hexes as well. Yes. And you get a, a template. Tem yeah, template on the back. <coughs> That's good. Uh, a bit too shiny, but there's a hexagon oh, there. How many did you get in there? Let's tell you. 30. 30. What do you reckon you can do with 30? I don't know how big this is going to come out, by the way. There's no. What's, sorry, what size would I. Do you know that? Says assorted. That looks. No, I was going to say I could maybe get a stocking out of it, but I might not be able to. I don't know a bigger. Anyhow, I'm going to have. I will try. Mm. <laughs> Even because I was thinking, all oh, this lovely fabric that's here. I think it's. You know, I really want to make myself a liberty bag, but you know, it's, it's for Sally, not for me. <laughs> you know, I don't have to go out and buy myself anymore. Mm. I can actually do some um, some things. Yeah. Yeah, they didn't have purple. They had blue mostly and pink. So wow. Well, I I know you've got a lot of blues, I'll get you pink. I like pink. Mm -hmm. Well, I've said that I do like the blues. Okay, Especially like nice. the aquas. Yeah. And I like the strawberry thief. I need to get some strawberry thief rather than myself. Mm. That one's probably, that one's the yeah. brightest. Yeah. <clears throat> but the thing is, I can maybe see what patterns they are and maybe get up a bit more to go with them. Mm. I have got a, what have I got now? It's a... Rolls. Jelly rolls. Jelly I bought a jelly roll which I bought, which is sort of quite dear when I bought it. I mean, yeah. going back five years now. Yeah. And I found it out the other week and I put it away again. I don't know where I put it. Rolled away. Because that, I don't know, I could just do a strip um, quilt. Mm -hmm. or, I mean, I know people chop it up and that. I don't know. Yes. Well, I need to look for that because oh, that, that's all in shades of blue as well. Mm -hmm. Oh, what's that that popped up on the screen? <laughs> oh, I don't know. Um, We've just hit 40 minutes, it's fine. 40? Yeah. Right, so that means it started again then. Has it? Okay. <laughs> well, great. Well, it, it, it is still filming, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's okay. Because the first time I think we did this, it, it went off. <laughs> right, well, we better get cracking because this will take seven hours to yeah, export. To upload. <laughs> So what's the next thing have we got on the list? Or I think that was there? everything. Uh, do you have? Do you know what you're doing for the giveaway? Because obviously it's got to be Liberty Jean, doesn't it? 
No, that's it. We've covered the we've covered the list. I don't know to be honest. I had thought of something, but it's not it's not got anything to do with Olivia. So. It's, you, it's supposed to match the theme. <laughs> I know. Um, Are you still thinking about it? I think. Yeah, actually, maybe, maybe it mm. could be something like some um, some hexagons or paper piece instead of something with a little bit of fabric. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I think, I think. I'm not sure yet, but I haven't got to say now, have I? No, no. Well, it gets announced a week <laughs> before the end of the month. But yeah. since we're late, we you haven't got as much time. No, I know. I know. Mm -hmm. I know. <laughs> So yeah, yeah, it's Liberty Month. Uh, I've the, got a too, so I know. <laughs> the festive feeling box will be available soon when we've got all the the Tomties and all our little gnomes sorted out. What we're going to do in the kit. Yeah. So yeah, if you, just, I'm sure we'll do a separate video for that at some point. I think so. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. We'll do a separate little one. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. So yeah. Well, I think that's probably about everything, isn't it? I know. I've not got any other news to to say. Have I? I don't think so. No. We'll think about ten things after we send oh, it off. Yeah, we'll see. Well, thank you for joining us this mm -hmm. month. Hope you enjoy the Liberty Month, and yeah. well, we'll see you again next month, won't we? Mm -hmm. so. Got any suggestions for anything? Just pop them down in the, the comments yeah, below. So if there's any questions mm -hmm. you want to ask, you know, just pop them down below, and uh, we will answer next yes. month. Yes. Yeah. And well, you'll see them. I oh, will see you yeah, next, next, next week vlog. Time, really, for the vlog, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Thank you for joining us, and we'll yeah. see you again next month. Yeah. Bye. Bye.